I know what we can't touch them. They're not ours. They're cool though. You're such a good girl though. Thank you for listening. Ferris wheels? They're windmills. You shouldn't keep your put your hands in your mouth though or outside. Don't don't bite your nails. It's not a good habit to start. Come on, we need to get pedaling though. Let's go. Come on. Mommy's gonna be home soon. We need to get back. We're far away. We're like still a half a mile away. She rode a whole mile today. Well, she will. This is nothing though. She's rode two miles one day. We're out here two and a half hours. I couldn't believe the endurance in this girl. It's like she just doesn't get tired. But she keeps me in shape, you know. I'm always on my feet. I never have a time to relax. Zero times for video games. I mean, don't get me wrong, we'll play it like a little bit here and there, but no more than an hour at a time. I want to teach her balance. I don't want her being on a game all day long. And I would like her to do other stuff. And I just don't think it's healthy playing games all day. When I used to play all day, I would get like. I don't know. I just felt less healthy, you know, always not sitting down, so when I would work. No, 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 we need to go back. You tricked me. We're gonna, this is towards home. <laughs> You're cute. But yeah, as I was saying, you know, like, it's just, it's just a lot. But. You know, I've people that do play for a living, you know, I mean, it makes them happy and that's what they want to do, you know. I can't really knock anyone, you know. Everybody's still free to do what they want. We're in a free country. Even if she wants to do that, you know, I guess I really can't knock her, but I would prefer she did something more active, which is going to, in turn, be more healthy, you know cardiovascularly stuff like that it may be good for her brain but you know that's where I'm leading at I don't want her to turn into a couch potato it's easy to do just me being laid off and since kind of turned me into it's like hard to go back to work you know and, and I'm doing it but it's like, I got used to being a stay-at-home dad, and I love it, and I couldn't have anybody else watch Lexi. I I have to have Andrea do it. I'm just worried nobody's going to be able to take care of her like we can, and I'm not ready to let her go yet. Maybe when she's four, one more year. crazy. I know I am a little bit, but I am more passionate about most things than normal people are. Look, Lux, don't kill him. It's a, it's a caterpillar. Look at him. He don't bite. Don't be scared. He doesn't bite. Watch. He doesn't bite me, don't be loud, you'll stir. Oh. Alright, let's put him somewhere where he won't die. We'll put him on this tree. What? Don't fall off me, caterpillar. Alright, I'm gonna put him on this tree so he can go. Oh, he just went to the bathroom on me. He's scared. I'll let him be right there. He's like terrified. Sorry, buddy. Come on, leave him alone. He's sleeping. 
He's, he's pretending to be dead because I startled him. He's not dead. Lexi already knows what death is. But, yeah, I like use these videos as like a journal to me. And these are just my thoughts, you know, I'm not telling everyone else how to live their life. It's just, you know, you can't make any money playing video games unless you're the best. And there's way too much competition and people doing it. It's very hard now to get into that. But more ladies probably would have attention since she's attractive. If she was good at it, she probably would get more attention, especially big talker like her father. So, uh... Let's see, we're going farther away from home. We gotta get back. Turn around, sweetie. Mommy's there waiting for us. You know, we gotta get back. Well, sorry about the pauses in my video. Um, I think that route wraps it up. That's my thought for the day. Uh, like I said, it's nice to be at home, but at the same time, my work ethic, it's like I feel like I have to work to be normal because I've been pushed to work since I was 13 years old by my father. So that's just what I know. And, you know, when I was getting this government 600 extra a week, it was nice. But I felt like it was too good to be true and because I know I got to go to work and you turn down work. They don't care, you know, if Andrea has to work nights and I'll never see her and have a very distant relationship. No, we're going to work around each other. We won't have any days off together, but at least we don't have someone else watching our kid and have to pay for that. So that's just the American dream, you know. Two people have to work to drive an old car, making 16 an hour to live in an $800 a month apartment and drive an old car, which is fine. I'm very happy with that. Don't get me wrong. I just feel like we should get a little more, you know, for this country. But other countries I know have to work all day, live in a hut. So, you know, I'm very grateful. Like, don't get me wrong. Well, this is just my rant for today about life. Been at home for eight months now, so I've been thinking about just everything. I want a good future for my daughter, and I don't want her to have to work really hard like we have to. to and she wants both parents home 24 hours a day, which is just not going to be possible. I feel like... I see. I feel like people should only have to work 30 hours a week and that's it. One person to take care of their family and that should be it. But that is it for my rant. I feel like I've gotten way off topic. I was just trying to talk about the bike ride. And I just kept talking. Whatever felt to my mind came to my mind. And that's that. And I got to get off here and watch my daughter get that doggy. Y'all have a good day. God bless.